hello there youtubers it's the uh, the 9th of January year 2024 um, both Australian Eastern Daylight Time and uh, local Beijing time <clears throat> by the time I am filming this video um, I know you won't um, I, I, I know you you guys won't um, be able to see this um, instantly A anyway since um, my internet was um, ha has been cut since um, yesterday night at around you know 20 22 p.m. before I you know right before no, um, well right before I, I was um, planning to hibernate you know but you know at, at the time I was already lying on bed pre you know watching some Starcraft 2 vids <laughs> you know preparing to end yesterday in a rather um, <coughs> cliche and uh, <coughs> ordinary fashion <coughs> yes um yes i do figured it's because that um the you know it, it, it ran out of credit but i currently have no you know local means to recharge it and I, I, I suppose you know, that pretty much you know leaves me with you know a couple of o o options plan A is to wait for my adopted mom slash one of my aunts to come and visit me to come and visit me visit me again and ask for help <laughs> Option number B, I, I suppose, you know, will consist of me going back to another, you know, state of homelessness slash exile by returning to a hotel nearby, you know, by ch checking into a, a hotel near, nearby and rather <coughs> ironically, um, that will be, you know, that would be the hotel, you know, the very first hotel, you know, I had to <clears throat> check in and stayed for about, you know, a couple of weeks, you know, probably, you know, less than a week. And I, I and I, and then I, I was forced to move, to relocate, to move out to another one. <clears throat> so that's, um, yes, spells quite the amount of tragedy and afflictions so we speak um yeah so pr pretty much you know I, I i i can't do um much w without a access to the global internet I I except you know uh you know a handful of some other tasks, some other un unfinished tasks pending to get wrapped up, um, stored and um, that are stored locally on my Dell Latitude computer. Um, you know, yes, I, I, I do have, in, in fact, you know, um, plenty of unfinished projects here. Um, stored locally on this on this Dell Latitude PC um, you know such as some unfinished Photoshop um, tasks some editing and uh, yes some some raw videos um, I need to process before I can get them uploaded publicly onto YouTube and BitChute and some other platforms. 
Ähm. Basically, yeah. And uh, to my surprise, um, though it's not really that much of surprise, you know, that I still m manage to retain much of my sanity by not actually killing myself or using or acting upon the intrusive thoughts to use the kitchen knife to to chop chop to 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 <clears throat> to to send the, uh, some waves of chop 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 on, 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 onto my head um yeah probably you know i just you know don't want to see it end like this since you know i have pin pin i managed to pinpoint a target a destination for myself in, in the future though it still remains a question whether i would live to see it or live to actual actualize it you know they are just you know <clears throat> A lot of um, you know factors and elements that you know um, you know I'm stretching be, you know currently currently or m momentarily beyond my my reach beyond my range of control. Or at, or at least so I think, at least so I reckon. And you know the um, the basic, the most you know the most fundamental tactic or strategy um, shall pretty much remain the same when it comes to dealing with that wicked woman, um, a AKA you know the female human individual who allegedly popped me out from her stinking vagina <coughs> or stinking twat stinking cunt <coughs> whichever you 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 whichever way you prefer to say it although i will still <coughs> nevertheless keep it as civil um <coughs> and you know as professional a a as i can i'll try not I'll try my best not not to say anything vulgar or profane or anything blasphemous. You know, you know, for example, you know the f word, the, the you know the you know the um, the most uh, most uh, typically speaking, you know. Colloquially known as um, se the seven dirty words, <laughs> yeah. But um, yes, still uh, on the other hand, I, I just can't help it. But you know, tend to use, you know, t t tend to say some of them. You know, um, e except the the f word and the b word. Yes, as you can, you know, most likely notice that yes, oftentimes I I still say shit or shite, and sometimes twat, cunt, you know, mostly for the sake of pra pra practicing, you know, to speak in a posh, you know, British a accent. Um, you know, just to pra you know, to to you know, for the sake of pr pr um, for the sake of pr practicing my you know my British um, accent of e English. Um, since you know, I I have nobody else you know to talk to in e English I, I, after my old man kicked his bucket. And uh, you know the and again you know the the five year survival rate keeps re, re you know keeps kind of you know keeps me going 
this far. Um, since yes, as I mentioned before in in one of or two of my previous videos, you know, if you do say if you do manage, you know, to survive, you know, the first five years of of uh, anything tragic, say. You know, though, though I'm not trying to 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 wish you ill or wish something bad ha happening to you, but you know, just a, well, just saying, I'm just you know making an assumption. Say, you know, um, for for example, if you do manage to survive, you know, the fifth year or after five years of. Uh, 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 of a certain tragic event, say loss of loved ones, you know, um, severe illnesses or diseases, or you know, or you know, or anything else, blah blah blah, you know, that you know that pretty much suggests that at, at least you know you yourself should you know give you and should give yourself an opportunity to tr try if see you know to try so that you can you know you see if you know things can you know can can, can make a big turn for good you know t t t towards the better side you know um slash you know i consider it a way that you know god telling you not to commit suicide um if you do manage to survive the fifth year um after a you know a you know a tragedy occurred to you you know that's what we call you know five years of survival rate you know in terms of medicine in terms of um you know <clears throat> in, 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 you know um in terms of what um medical professionals say a physician um tend to use to to quantify the you know the outlook the prospect of a of an illness or a disease so yeah and uh, you know so so it's quite It is hard, yeah. You know, it's if if you are a man, you know, you uh, particularly if you are a you know if you ha ha happen to share an identity um with me as a at least physically speaking a fully grown man, and you run into you know a bunch of problems and you know uh, of you know great afflictions that inflict a great amount of damage and pain to you so great that you can barely you know get back on, on your feet you pretty you pretty much you know you have absolutely nobody else to back you up to give you a helping hand you know you are we are pretty much all all alone you know and you know the only thing that you know all, all, only pain death destruction lo loneliness illnesses blah 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 all, all those bad things hard hardships you know come without the price you know, a a aka free. You know, a everything else we'll have to work our asses off. 
to go for it, to earn it. That's the, unfortunately, the sad reality here. Um, yeah, the, well, you know, that's the bad news, you know, bad, bad, bad news is that, you know, we suffer a, a, alone, we die alone, we, you know, we do everything in our power, in our range of capabilities to get, to try so hard to get back on our feet. Um, you know, no matter what happens. And yeah, but the good news is, you know, if you take, you know, if uh, if you, you adopt a nihilistic and a stoic approach, they won't last f for forever, though they will, yes, it will feel as if they last f for forever, but they don't. Well, you get the picture, you know. And, and the good news is, uh, another uh, good news is that, you know, so long as you um, put in some, some hard work, you will begin to see at least, you know, a trace amount of positive changes. Though not very much, um, you, you know, that says, you know, we will more or less have to, um, you know, to spend a, a lot of time to, to accumulate, to gather up, to stack up, you know, tiny, tiny bits of successes, tiny bits of vic um, victories into grandiose ones, into a m mighty one. You know that will earn respect and and awe from from others, regardless of genders or you know nationalities or ethnic ethnicities. Blah blah blah. Yeah. So you know, unfortunately, you know, um, sooner or later, I'll have to make that choice. And I believe um, you guys do too. I believe, you know, so do you guys, sooner or later. Um, so just make sure you don't do um, anything um, stupid you don't do you don't make a, 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 any move that you will come to huge regrets later on um you know just don't do anything rash don't do anything stupid and uh, most likely you, you, you'll be fine, though you won't be that happy, <laughs> you know, with, um, about life or, or with your lives. But yeah, um, just don't do anything stupid. Keep, keep, keep it real. Yeah. So yeah, I'll see what, what else I can do, you know, to make my day here more productive, less, you know, degenerate, less in vain. Um, yeah, how, you know, from, from, you know, not just from now on, you know, for each and every one of us, more or less, we will have to take, you know, take, um, spend every day, no matter happy or, unha or unhappy, as if it's going to be the last day, the final day. 
Um, yeah, so just don't take anything for granted and make the best make the best out of anything you have, even pain, you know. And uh, you know that's one you know one thing that I've one one more thing that that I've learned throughout you know the last couple of years is that you know you don't you know as a man you know as a mentally strong man at least you know you you don't ask for instant relief from your pain. You need to learn to grow, you know, you learn from your pain, your afflictions, your problems that life or God or Satan th throws at you and learn from it and, and you know, grow e into someone stronger, someone more adaptive, someone more capable, you know, do not necessarily though not necessarily someone more talented because pretty much you know t t talent means and brings you nothing you know when you you know when facing great afflictions w w without great resolve great de determination to overcome it so yeah other than that you know i have nothing new nothing else to report to you guys and to myself so yeah stay strong keep it real um don't do anything stupid long story short if god's still willing um hope to see hopeful hope hope to see you guys next time on youtube and in Europe. Take care, stay safe. Until next time, if God's still willing, au revoir. Cheers. Bye.